Welcome back, MTG Joe here, and we are going to be playing some more best of one action, this time in Historic. This is a Demir uh, Sublime Gear Hulk deck. Um, Demir Hulk, if you would. Um, but basically, you are leveraging a bunch of instants with Torrential Gear Hulk um, to kind of combo out. With Sublime Epiphany, you can make copies of your Gear Hulk, which is pretty cool. Um, so you have stuff like Frasca's Contempt, some counters, some card draw. Um, and then some removal as well uh, that can all be flashed back with Torrential Gear Hulk. Um, you can also at instant speed cast the memory half to draw your cards. With Narset out, you get to draw seven, your opponent gets to draw one card, um, which is always a fun interactive uh, fashion. Um, and then we have access to three Sweepers main, Extinction Event, and Shadow's Verdict, which is very good against a lot of the um, aggressive decks right now. I'm actually considering potentially going up one more uh, sweeper, which I think I will. I think we're going to cut a sensor and go up a languish in the main. I think I want to have access to four sweepers. Um, but basically with the deck you want to control, you have some ramp early. Um, and then you can win through Scarab God, Torrential Gear Hulk, Hardcast Shark Typhoon, or the one of the fun of Crawling Barons. Um, so there's a sideboard here, but we'll be playing this in best of one action. Um, we had a nice run in standard going to 271. Um, so let's take this to Historic and see if we can continue our rank up. Um, so really what we want to play with this deck is like Angels. Uh, elves can be a little quick, but we do have tools to beat them. The blue-white matchup is probably 50-50, 60-40 them. Um, and best of one is kind of so-so. Uh, this hand's great. Yusup. As always, if you are catching this on YouTube, if you can, drop a like and comment. It goes a long way to helping to support the channel, and it is free to help out that way. If you are, like many today, joining us live on Twitch, uh, if you want to know when I go live, you can always hit that follow button. Give them a hello. They got that. These sleeves are really cool. They're the secret lair ones. Okay, so probably elves. I think we just want to ramp into Shadow's Verdict here. Um, I think with sensor, because what I want to do is keep them off Coco, but we have the sensor there, so let's go white ma uh, blue mana here. I'm just considering killing this now, or actually I can't counter the green spells. We can do this all on their turn. I also have commit to memory. So maybe I just let them play everything out and then we just sweep them. We're only taking three points of damage. What's my favorite fruit? Probably watermelon. <laughs> What's yours, Zuzun? Um, that's fine. Do I want to... I th think we're gonna do this. It tempos them out a bit. I want them to commit more to the board here. Um, probably just... Black mana. I have blue, 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 I have black, black, let's go black. So here I have the options of eliminate, 
Their board's not huge. I want to catch them. On like collected company here. Guess I'm taking a bit of damage. Okay, so that's probably Coco. So I think here we're just casting Behold. If they want a Coco now, it's fine. Both of these are really good. Um, I can cycle for a land. I think we're just doing kill you. Because this lets them think that I don't have... Okay, that's actually great. We're just being patient. Because if they Coco here, they don't have Coco. again here let's just be patient I guess I should have done that on end step if they want a coco here it's advantageous to us anyways Languish is nice. Actually, that doesn't do what I wanted to do. Okay, so they're being patient here. If they attack this turn, I'm going to try to bait them into it. So I can block and fatal push here. So they can Coco in response. Yeah, I, I want to just kind of get better value than what's on the board. And because they've been holding up collected company mana, I'm afraid to sweep here um, and then them just be able to play around it. So we'll fatal push here, clear their board. And now I always have a blocker up. Because the Shadow's Verdict, yeah, that's perfect. I should have chosen Eliminate here, but it's fine. So kill this. Block here, and now I can Shadow's Verdict. That's great. Languish here. Get some points of damage in, and now we're in a good spot. Because now I have Shadow's Verdict as well. I have these to potentially find card draw. Six mana. That's fine. Again, I don't care how wide they go this turn. Just because I'll have the ability to Shadow's Verdict away. So they do this preemptively, hoping that there's something on top. I can two for one them here. I'm going to crack this, get a card draw.
This is another way to enable revolt. That's a good draw. Um, I think we're just doing this. Don't want to do this until I can find Narset. And the reason we did this this turn is because now I don't have to minimize my damage. So they still have collected company outs, but this should allow us to start drawing some cards. Land's pretty good here. Perfect. Because now I can do this. Now we scurb godding. Do one on their end step. Well, actually, there are no creatures. Oops. Guess when we exiled everything. <laughs> it's fine. I like the position we're in. With Sublime Epiphany, yeah, this is easy GG's. Oh, they're also at five life. You got me. Show them sublime anyways. Got him. Patience, patience. 214. Elves is a pretty good matchup, like I said. We have a, enough chip removal and then the sweepers to catch up. Shadows Verdict's just an absolute house in the format right now. And this, so our approach there would differ if we were playing against something like Mono Red that has reach damage, but Mono Green typically does not have any sort of haste in elves unless they're on a Crater Hoof build, which you don't really see. Um, so it is okay in that case to play it out. Um, we go first, we'll keep this. This is a decent hand. Uh, generally, you'll lead on Swamp to bluff that you have Fatal Push. So this is actually an interesting turn. I think what we're going to do is a Scanta just to set up our draws. It's the Cardboard Live one, Commando. I gotta shut off Stream Decker. For some reason, it just, it really wants to talk about Mono White Control. Uh, but the deck list is up here as well. Uh, it is a Demir Torrential Gear Hulk um, kind of control deck. What are the chances opponents on Cat Tribal? Everyone's really friendly today. Elves. Elves. Fatal push is nice. Um, I think what we want to do still is try to find our sweeper. This is kind of turned off with this Allosaurus Shepherd, anyways. Um, anything that's not a sweeper goes away. Um, so we're actually going to do, no, I can't, it's going to say we are going to set it up with revolt in, for one of their three drops. I think we're actually just gonna push this now. Or let's get rid of Allosaurus. I guess I should have waited in that case. I wanna have this saw coming up as a potential counter spell. We need to still dig for counters. 
Um, Shark Typhoon's actually pretty good. Let's me potentially trade in combat here. At least with the War Master. They have a ton of mana. If they try to like collect a company here. So we'll get blue mana here. So opponent this game has had a better start than last. Could have Coco here for two lords. But we gotta take that chance. They had it. Only one lord. Fuck. Okay, so we really need that sweeper. Languish or Shadows Verdict? Nope. Nope. How far were we? getting there so they hit exactly that like we were we weren't gonna really get there without I think we might want one more sweeper Yeah, probably one more sweeper. Let's play a second language. Octasy, thank you for the follow. How's it going? Haven't taken many losses. Stefan, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Uh, were you? Did you just beat me on elves, or did I beat you on elves? I, I played the elves back to back two games in a row. So I won one and I lost one. Were you on the winning side with the clutch Coco? Yeah, that was a clutch Coco. I was trying to dig. I have um, like Shadows Verdict, Languish, and Extinction Event. Um, I was just hoping for like one turn you didn't have Double Lord. I figure your attack meant that you did have um, Coco. Good games, nonetheless. You dropped me a hundred spots almost. Okay, they are on mono red ramp. Yeah, with elves, like, I usually find the games, like, one party wins by a large margin. Either you're winning by a lot or you're losing by a lot. So opponent's ramping like hell here. We need to find some counters. Um, don't think I care about Solemn. Yeah, that's probably fair and best of one. Like, you're not going to beat a sweeper oftentimes. Especially, like, sweeper, sweeper. Like, the other game that I played. My... Um, like my opponent just couldn't beat double sweeper there. I think here we're gonna crack this push. That's why elves is like really good in best of one. I don't think it's as good in best of three because it's easier to hate out. Um, probably just letting that happen. We have a lot of lands here. I need a sweeper. Oh, that's actually really good. The 
This lets me take them off Faceless Haven. I want to get enough cards down low. Guardian Idol's annoying. Okay, so we have Gear Hulk. So they might just animate this Guardian Idol here. If they go faceless, I have that as an option as well. We're just taking the damage here, killing this on end step. Um, I would rather you don't have Karn. Karn just gets like enough stuff that makes my life hell and in this next turn i can do this on end step Ooh, narset okay so i need to set it up where i can keep narset alive So I can Shadow's Verdict. Because I want to draw the cards and not let them draw the cards. Okay, so we're doing this. Shadow's Verdict. Let's them come in. So I think we are Shadow's Verdicting this turn. They get Karn though. So I think the line is Narset here. Shuffle their library. I know Fatal push. Yeah, that's the line. I have just Sick. So I do have to get another swamp here. So take them off this. Oh no, I just have islands left. No! Damn it. We drew all our swamps. I needed the fatal push here. Should have checked. That's fine. The shadows verdict will be better. Yikes. Needed the opening there. Needed a turn there. Um, so I can Gear Hulk do that. Gear Hulk memory. It's not great. Get Shadows Verdict. We're just Shadows Verdicting here. We're at 14 already. I have these two fatals. That line really hurt us. Needed that Narset to live. Probably would have died anyways, just because they had the Stomp and that. Do this, kill that, because I'm going to Gear Hulk next turn, and then I'm going to refill our hand. I think we're just doing this. Because I don't care how many cards are in their hand, because I'm going to Gear Hulk. Could hard cast Shark Typhoon, which isn't bad. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. So 
one's been interesting. I cycle sweltering. Because this can minus on my gear hulk. Oh, they found another faceless. Actually think this turn. Because I want to ambush them the next turn. This gives them the most options though. So if I do this on my end step. Okay, I think we're taking six here. Let them make the token here. And I'll gear Hulk memory. This Ugin's just farming us. I think we need to go back to standard. It's killing out that blue white list. Sure. It's clearly something they want. Okay. Gonna put a clock on us. Or is it getting a little warm in here? So I guess I could have memoried it. Don't love giving him seven cards here. Could commit it. Do they have a braid? They have a braid. Yeah, we're dead. My deck's not really beat, like built to beat this matchup. We're kind of more creature focused than having an uncountable planeswalker. And then us just not timing it well. One and two. One and two. Give this one one more. See if it's not panning out. Jack, artisan of images. Um, we go first. We're going to fetch a swamp here. So Island lets these two come untapped, but we have double black here. So I'm more concerned of hitting that. His hand is very based on them having a creature deck. If we're playing against like blue-white control, then we're in a bad spot. It's fine. We have Shadow's Verdict, which is nice. So let's do this. Set it up. Their play on two I'm not as worried about. If they start looping Cat, it's fine. They have the Tread Horde. We can hit it for two. So we'll wait to see what they play out here. Do you want to hit a land, ideally? 
So the devil, I think we're just... I think we're doing this. We want to hit land here. That's great. Um, so I could take a turn in our set. I think we're just doing that. Take three points of damage. If they have a cat, it's kind of bad, but you can try to draw a fatal push. So here, if they attack my Narset, I can just push it. If not, I get to keep my Narset around. So I think here, we're just doing this. They can sack for a point of damage, they draw a card, but then that means my future removal doesn't draw multiple cards. Still don't know if they're on green or strict black red. So depending what they play out here, I'm inclined to Immersion Predator. That's fine. We're going to Languish. So we'll take three here. They could only make this go up to four. Um, I actually think I want both of these. So we languish here. So if they're on Predator, they're probably just strict black red. Then I have Fatal Push if they have a, a two drop. See what they exile here. I guess they get two food this way. We're looking for a land here for the Gear Hulk. Another double. Fine. We have Eliminate. Okay, so we have Typhoon as well. So, actually don't think we're doing that. I think we're just doing this. No, we're gonna do it on their turn. Because I want to have Counterspell up as well. I want to kill their thing and counter whatever their play is. Don't care about priests. But in case they have like a haste effect, let's kill this now. That should be two devils down. Tap some out for turn. Puts me to seven. I can fatal push this, so it's fine. 
question is, so what's in my graveyard right now? Behold that. I think I want to find a land here. My life total is getting pretty low. Never lucky. So we counter whatever their play is here. Cat's really bad at this point. I'm going to have to Shadows Verdict it. That's also quite scary. Land. We need to hit a land here. Um, I think we're just playing this tapped for the life. So they have an opening here, but if they don't go crazy, I can shadows that. Ah, uh, that's bad. That's bad. Need a like fatal push. I think we do this. This puts me down to three. They've used three Dread Hordes already. This gets through a lot of stuff. Don't really have a way to gain life in the deck. We might want... Um, What's it called? Cat's really bad for us right now. Okay, so we have memory as well. So Gear Hulk's gonna go behold here. Actually probably gonna crack this anyways. Because I have the sublime now. One, two, three. Another gear hulk's nice. Okay, I'm gonna keep the mana up. They might have like a braid or something. So if I do this, one, two, can't do everything I want. I need to just dodge cat here. So I need this to put a cat on top of their library. The Akron War. I have Saw coming. Mm. This could be baiting a cat. I just can't afford a cat to resolve because they have enough triggers with where my life total is at. Thinking the 
life here. We probably want like cling to dust or something. Let's draw a card. Lord Jojo, thank you for the follow. How's it going? Ooh, that's actually pretty good because I can shuffle away. The cat next turn. I need a way to gain life in this deck. Do you gain life? No, your opponent loses life. So we'll do this. They shuffle the cat. And then I can Escanta this turn. Um, sensor is just a free card draw. They have enough mana that it doesn't matter at this point. Notably, they didn't have um, any more basics. Barons is cool. Another Gear Hulk. Just play it safe. They didn't gain life. So I'm gonna memory it back on top. can go away. How's that sound, friend? Got him! Whew. That one was uh, a bit of navigation required. Alrighty, so we got up to... We peaked in like the 200s, like high 200s. We lost a couple in historic now, so we dropped back down to 340, but overall it was a pretty solid run. 